Hi, Brody. This is Brian from San Ramon. Uh, regarding the wooing at the Shark Tank. Oh, boy. Um, not a big fan of it either. Um, but I'm just wondering the genesis of it. I don't know why it is what it is. I don't know where it came from. I don't know why they're doing it. I don't know what it means. Um, it's really annoying. Um, uh, so there you go. I don't know. Wh- whatever you can find out, I, I, it's just annoying me. Okay. Uh, have a good one. Bye. <laughs> I appreciate the call, Brian, and I could sense your annoyance uh, in that voicemail. You kind of didn't even know how to end it. Like, oh, just just get me out of here. Um, the origin. Uh, Ric Flair, I suppose. Uh, I think that's the obvious. We all know that. But, yeah, how did it get to SAP Center, and how does it continue on such a regular basis? I've got so many thoughts on this. I didn't really organize any of them, so if this is messy, I apologize, but here we go. I think what annoys people is that If you're at the game, right, you don't like it there, but just as many people watching it at home on television uh, with nice surround sound systems, they can all hear it as well, too. So you're not just annoying people at the game. You're annoying tens of thousands and thousands and thousands more who are trying to just watch the game on television at home. Now, usually these fans are doing this at a late portion of the game when it's relatively more quiet at the at the tank because maybe the sharks are up like they were the other night, three, nothing. And all of a sudden it gets to be three, two and the wooing goes away really fast. What is the wooing all about? Are you bored? Would you rather not be there? Are you looking for attention? Are you trying to come off as smart? Like what, what is the purpose of it? Right. You're asking Brian the origin. And by the way, I really do appreciate that voicemail because a lot of people were talking about that, especially after the other night. But what are you trying to get accomplished? And does it does it look good on your fellow fans to be doing that? So if you can answer those things for me, honestly, and come up with good reasons, go ahead, keep wooing. But I'm pretty sure that that's kind of a a dead end of the conversation right there. So I don't like it either. Um, it, does it stop me from watching the games? No, obviously. I want to. I need to. I have to. <laughs> but it's it's something I don't understand. Um, we've now seen it for a couple years, and that's the thing, right? You get the feeling like, uh-oh, that's not a quick fad. It's staying around. It's not going away. In fact, maybe it's getting worse. And me not being up in the second deck, which is where I think it originates, I don't I don't have a read on it, but... It's also one of those things where if you're up there and you see somebody sitting next to you doing it, are they ashamed? Does anybody have a report on that? Like, does anybody have firsthand experience, eyewitness experience? Uh, I'd be interested to know.